Hello guys and welcome along to a brand new series of Adam Tries. This is I Am Setsuna. Now this is a title that came out last year on PC and it was a launch title with a Nintendo Switch. Um, it was marketed on the idea that it was going to be a spiritual successor to one of the greatest JRPGs of all time, Chrono Trigger. Apparently the dev team, Tokyo RPG Factory, who were there, um, Oh, uh, wait, did I just point the right way? I don't know, I can't figure it out. Um, uh, are huge fans of Chrono Trigger and they decided, you know, no one really makes games like that anymore, so why don't we? Um, I'm a huge fan of games like this. Chrono Trigger is one of my favorite games of all time, just like with them. This score you can currently hear um, is done by the guy who scored Titanic. Uh, which is which is crazy. So you know, good score, um, classic JRPG, and apparently the story is still supposed to be super. S the theme of this game is sadness. So, do you want to turn on in-game voices? I think I do. I think they'll be in Japanese, but let's do this. Um, yeah, very excited. Way more excited for this than I was with that goddamn Dawn of War. Hey, man. Hmm, seems like you live up to the rumors. A natural mercenary, or? Hey, old man. Perhaps my own skills and mercenary should simply grow weak. Hey, it's Hapspa. Hey, Hapspa. I feel like your parents didn't name you very well, Hapspa. What's your name? Do you want to change Endia's name? No, Endia's an awesome name. Nice to be working with you, Endia. It's worth noting I don't know anything about this game. I know what the Wikipedia page has told me, and I skipped over the plot section. Our mission is to recover a young girl who's been kidnapped by monsters. Your job will be to exterminate any monsters we encounter along the way. Once it's done, I shall return the girl to our client. Of course. Hey, Hapspa. If she's alive, that is. Bom bom bom. Let's be right away. You're ready to go. Oh, okay. So this is M. Deer. You can see this is this is his face. He's wearing a mask. That's cool. Are those cat ears? I hope not. Um. We should, uh, should we play him like a dick? Let's play him like a dick. Like a cocky, a cocky dick. <laughs> Feisty one, eh? Of course, I won't be getting involved in the combat, except in an advisory capacity. All right, old man. It'd be a good chance for me to see your ability. Come on, let's go. All right, cool. Right, so, movement, eight directions. L love it, love it. I mean, uh, I get it. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, it's a pe It's an adorable penguin with terrifying teeth. It seems we've already entered their territory. Time to get to work, Andy. Ready to go? Wait a minute. Unfortunately, I don't think the monsters want to wait around. A puny foe, but you can never be too careful. Look at its teeth. If you approach it without it noticing, you should be able to strike first. All right. Okay. In combat tactics for everything, stay calm and focused at all times. Active time battle. I know what an active time battle is. I'm fine. Of course, I'm sure you're already well aware of this. Oh, that's not even a cute penguin noise. Oh, that's his voice. We're going to attack. It's active time battle, so it kind of behooves me to... um. Alright, we've got attacks. We don't have items. We have potions. Fine. His name's Pengy. In London streets, being Peng is, 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 it means, it means you're quite fit. Bit of London slang for you. Uh, right, so you can add momentum. It, it, they'll explain on that later. I've had a little go of it. Um, I walked through this area because I just wanted to know whether it's suitable. Because you've got to do that. You've got to do that as a YouTuber. You always know what you're doing, which you say for now. Let's head on. I'm kind of, I'm deeply excited. I love a story game, guys. I love a story. I love a plot. Something to get me with with a score. Uh oh, there's two of them. Hey, haps <laughs> spat everywhere. There are more than th them than before. Use attacks to take them out at once. You have Spritnite stones on you, I presume. Who needs Spritnite stones? I'm a tug like this. You mean to say you've never used Spritnite? What an astonishing natural talent you must possess. I do. I do, I do, I do. You received Cyclone from Hapspa. <laughs> Equipping Sprit Knight allows you to use techs. 
Try that stone out. Alrighty, Sprint Knight. Right, okay, so this is the... Yeah, this is just an ability, right? Just having it in your possession is not enough. You must not forget to equip it. So I've got to equip that. Uh, so on the Sprint Knight menu, I'll go to all Sprint Knight, and I equip Cyclone. Boom, done. Used by, by ND. I don't know what fluxes are, but it has combos, so that's good. Be careful. It's okay. They're just terrifying penguins of doom. Mm, penguins of doom. Boom. So that was it. Oh no, they're hitting focus to get their slaps up to full power. I'm going to... Hold on. Get one momentum point. And momentum the penguins. And they dead. A majestic crest and an unknown shell. Nice job. Thanks, Hapspa. It's like Hapspa, the friendly ghost. What's next? A save point? That's conspicuous. A glowing ring of light. You can sense a faint magical energy emanating from inside it. Let's do it. What's the matter? Nothing. Sense the presence of monsters fell inside the woods, did you? All the more reason for us to hurry on. Alright, old man. Let me, let me, let me, let me save this mess. Save points for rings of light found in area. Yada, yada, yada. Pause it if you want to read it. I don't need, I don't need this stuff. I've got... Oh, what's that? Phew, she's still breathing. Who's this on the floor? Although not for long at this rate. Who is this? Uh-oh. It's a polar bear with gloves. And a horn. Just the one. Maybe like 1.5 horns, 1.1 horns. Another one. I'm much more powerful this time. Let's do it, half. <laughs> Looks like we're getting out of here alive without defeating this thing. No matter how powerful, every foe has its moments of weakness. You must seize such moments to strike. Alright. Oh, okay, I learn momentum mode. So what happens is you pick your attack, and then um, once you selected it, you hit X or whatever it is on the switch. And it, it makes it more powerful. You've got to time it. You have one last piece of work to do to take care of Endir. I'm counting on you. I feel like this isn't the last piece of work I have to do. Mimo Sukusi. Let's just... Ah, oh, I can't believe you clawed me. That's unreal. Alright, I've added some physical damage. I mean, think about adding momentum, right? Not actually the most time efficient thing. You can't just, like, wait for it to go on. Oh, he's gonna hit me for a bit. I'm gonna use a potion in a bit, and I'm gonna hit him for a bit. Oh, I killed him anyway. Oh, I was gonna use a potion. Ding! Leveled up for level two. Got some beehive claws and some high-grade honey. High-grade honey is actually very expensive nowadays, so that's... Sell that for a small fortune. Girl says dot. How does a girl say dot and everyone turns around and take notice of her? Dot, 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 dot. Dot, dot, dot. Maybe she's talking Morse code. Girl, huh? What's... You don't need to worry now. Um, I... Oh! The, the monsters. Where are the monsters? What's your name, girl? What's your name, girl? Don't worry, he took care of them. And I'm single, by the way. I'm safe, thank you, but why? You don't need to know that. Ah, oh, secrets! Oh, um, sorry. There's no need to be so uptight, Andy. She only just got over the monsters, and now she's scared of you. I'm trying to be mysterious. I wanna, I wanna get to know this girl, but I don't want her to know me. We're from the tribe of people who make their living as mercenaries who came here because we were hired by your father. Thank you so much. I'll be able to see everyone again. Thank goodness. Thank you. Thank you so much. Get out of here. Take this, Andy. Give me money. Thanks. Five thousand G's. I buy myself a second-hand car with that shiz. There's your share. Thanks very much. Thanks. It's time for us to go our separate ways, Endir. I should take this girl back to her father. Take care, Endir. The way he keeps saying my name is suspicious. What's what's his deal? Tell me, Endir. Hmm? How long do you plan to stay in this line of work? Uh, two options. Until the day I die, I've never even thought about it. Until the day I die. 
because I'm emo and goth. Well, I suppose it's not really like emo and goth to not have retirement. It's just sort of being a youth today. I mean, we, we ain't retiring. Oh, who's this guy? I'm gonna draw my sword. The music changed. Titanic guy changed the music, so I'm like, I'm on. Th I'm, 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 I know what your story is. Were I foe, I would already attack you from behind, would I not? Not that I think there's any way I could possibly feed a swordsman of your caliber. Of course, stop blowing smoke up me ass, mate. What's your deal? I've witnessed your ability, and dear. I have a mission I would like to ask you to complete on behalf of my master. And you think I'll accept, do you? Yes, I believe so. You will see through any mission, no matter how arduous. That's what I this is what I'm doing. The voice from Mysterious Man. That's what I have heard. It's sort of very nasal. Just off the coast of mainland, there's a small isle, and on that isle, there's a small village, and the small village, there's a small street, and the small street, and the small house, and the small house, there's some small stairs, and down the small stairs, there's a small basement, and in this small basement, three small skeletons lived, and a young girl who should turn 18 years old this year. My mission from you, Endear, is to kill her. Bum, bum, bum. I mean, that's that. That's it for this episode. I hope you're super hooked, because I've got to kill an 18. I've got to kill a 17-year-old girl before her 18th birthday. In England, uh, 18 is when you can start really getting drunk in pubs. So killing someone before their 18th birthday is 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 known as a dick move. Thanks very much for watching this episode. I'll see you in the next episode of So Buzzed. Adam tries, I am Setsuna. Goodbye.